Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In February 2024, the US administration issued a strong caution to Iran, warning of a decisive reaction from the global community if Tehran persists in supplying ballistic missiles to Russia. This warning came after Iranian officials acknowledged on February 21, 2024, that they had transferred over 400 short- and medium-range ballistic missiles to Russia since early January. The shipment included numerous Fateh 110 variants and several Zolfagar Road mobile solid-fuel short-range ballistic missiles, intended for use in the conflict in Ukraine. They also indicated that further deliveries would deepen military collaboration between the two nations in the forthcoming months. In the backdrop of the Ukrainian conflict, Russia aims to broaden its military supply channels by bolstering connections with Iran and North Korea. Despite making significant strides in its military industry, Russia faces challenges in meeting the demand for specific equipment like ballistic missiles, which have been extensively utilized to target Ukrainian infrastructure. Confronted with this predicament, Moscow has sought assistance from international partners such as Iran and North Korea. The missiles provided by Iran to Russia encompass the Zolfagar, short-range ballistic missiles developed by Iran, which have been operational since 2017. These missiles are known for their high maneuverability and reliable solid propulsion, boasting an operational range of approximately 700 kilometers and the capability to strike medium-distance targets with an estimated margin of error of 100 meters. The Zolfagar employs a guidance system that integrates inertial navigation with GPS positioning to enhance precision during strikes. This isn't the first instance of Russia employing Iranian armaments in Ukraine, as Shahed-136 suicide drones have been in use since the onset of the conflict. In addition to the Zolfagar, Iran has also supplied numerous Fateh-110 short-range ballistic missiles to Russia since the commencement of the conflict in Ukraine. Originally designed to replace aging Scud systems, the Fateh-110 is mounted on a 6x6 truck and can accurately hit targets up to 250 kilometers away with a precision of 250 meters. The missile has seen action in Syria and is reportedly in the possession of Hezbollah in Lebanon. For Russia, acquiring missiles like the Fateh-110 and Zolfagar, which are more cost-effective compared to domestically produced cruise missiles, presents an economical option to support its military efforts in Ukraine. That's all for now. See you later.